Hello everyone, Ted J here from the Google Docs and Google Drive Help Forum. It's that time of year again, March Madness. Time to pick your teams, build your brackets, and let's do it in Google Sheets. So I've built some templates and I'm going to show you how they work. So the first uh, template is the bracket template. So let's open that guy up here. Here's what it looks like. Uh, this is the actual template, so it'll be view only, but you'll need to make your own copy. But that's easy. Go to File, Make a Copy, Name it, and then you'll have your template. So here's my example. All you got to do is go to the Your Bracket tab and pick your team. So all these uh, yellow boxes here are all the drop downs and that you'll need to, 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 uh, to go through. So all you got to do is click on the drop down. It gives you the possible choices for that. Um, if you pick you know, Team 1 or Team 2, right now this is all test data, but that's how this works. Um, go through and pick all of your teams, and then you're ready to go, and you can just watch it, uh, watch it happen. It'll automatically give you points here. Um, based on this point guide, you can keep track of how many points you've earned as the uh, tournament tournament develops. You can the cool thing about this being on Google Sheets is you can share this with the world and people can see how your uh, how your brackets are doing. Um, but so a little bit more details is you know as the tournament develops, you'll see here that if you pick a team correctly, you'll get the yes, you'll earn the points, which I'll show in a second. If you pick incorrectly, you'll get the red and show you the team that actually won there, and this keeps track of all your points. But if you want to see how the points are actually being calculated, you can click on the points tab, and here it is. So this will put in all your picks once you populate them. This will put the actual winners, and if that's equal to that, you get whatever points are available here. If not, you get zero points. So this will show you where you earn points and where you don't earn points. So how are we getting the data um, for this? And so the Google Tournament function that used to exist in Google Sheets is no longer supported in old Sheets or new Sheets. So what I've done is I've created a master data source where I'm going to update every time there's a team that uh, wins a game that will automatically flow down into everybody's templates um, so you don't have to worry about you know typing in the winning and losing teams and that's what this full bracket does so this master spreadsheet key box up here actually goes and looks for my uh, spreadsheet that's live and public on the internet for anybody to find and pull data off of and pulls it in here so as long as this tab is working everything will update just wonderfully and this uses the power of the import range function which is a function that existed in old sheets and now new sheets as of a few days ago. So if you don't see it working in your version yet, it should be out very, very, very soon. It's um, slowly rolling out. So that's that. That's the individual, individual bracket. Very easy from the Your Bracket tab. Make all your choices and then just watch it happen. Uh, thanks for watching this video. If you want to learn a little bit more about how you can use this bracket template to run a pool, watch my next video. Till then, good luck.